what is your favorite thing about cosplay? Um, for me, I'm really, I don't know, because it's so, there's so much stuff that I love about cosplay, and it's really hard to say what, you know, what's my favorite. I hate favorite. I hate that word favorite, because I just love it all. But, um, I guess I'll just mention a few important things. Like, I've met so many friends through cosplay, because we're just all, you know, we're all together in this, and we're all kind of a minority in, in uh, the social world. So, I have met so many friends, and I love you all, all of you, you, I love you all. <laughs> Another thing that I love about cosplay is that I get to escape from the real world. I really disagree with a lot of the things that go on in this world. And so I get to step back, put on someone else's face, and just live their world for at least a day, a few hours, whatever. And it makes all this crazy crap that goes on in our world so much less heavy. It's, it's just so, it's a great feeling to be able to step back. Pickle Car says nine. Do you have any cosplay pet peeves? If so, what are they? I do. I have I have a list on sauce gay paper. <laughs> um so I'm gonna I'm just gonna, you know, read off my list because it uh, Alright. When it comes to cosplay construction, my number one issue besides the actual outfit is the wig. If you are against wearing wigs. Oh, wigs won't fit in my hair because I have long hair or I have thick hair. Bull crap. A wig will fit on anyone's head. My hair is so freaking thick. It like poofs out to way past my shoulders and it's terrible. And yet, oh my god, I fit it in a wig, you know. So anyone, anyone can fit their head in a wig. They make your costume look so much better, so much better, if you choose the right wigs and, you know, right colors, right, you know, style. Just wear wigs, people. If your character has crazy colored hair, don't spray your hair. I hate it when people do that. Don't spray your hair. Just get a wig because you will be able to wear it again instead of, you know, have to buy cans and cans of spray. And it always it makes your hair all crusty and nasty and just... Just appease me and get a wig. Shoes. Shoes. You, you you need to get your character shoes. If you're wearing sneakers with your Naruto cosplay, you look retarded. I'm sorry. You do. People do look at your shoes. I don't care what people say. Like, oh, they won't look at your feet. They do look at your feet. And you look like a freaking idiot if you're wearing sneakers with your Naruto, you know, traffic cone costume. So, if you can, get some shoes. Like, it's, it's not that hard also. I mean, yeah, shoes are a real pain to carry around in, like, you know, when you're traveling to co conventions and stuff. But, again, it makes your costume so much better if you get shoes. Just get the right shoes. Aside from the costume itself, flamers, cosplay flamers, I, I want to strangle them so bad. It's not necessary to say nasty things about other cosplayers. Oh, she's fat. Ew. You know, it's just, it's not necessary. Do you, like, get off on insulting people? Like, it doesn't make sense in my head. Just, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. Just leave them alone. They're, they're, we're here to have fun. That's the whole point of, of cosplay, really, to have fun, make friends. You insulting people is not helping. It's, you're destroying our community, and it sucks. That, that proud Asian dude on Gaia, you, he will get his ass kicked, destroyed, if he's, if his relocation is found out. Seriously. Like, I will personally punch him in the face and knee him in the nuts multiple times, because he is just ruining a lot of what cosplay is about. It's about having fun. It's not about, oh, Asians are the best. Shut the fuck up. If you add all those numbers together, it equals 10.
time for our last cast, uh, question. Yeah, question. Um, tell us about your most recent costume or whatever you're planning. Yeah, that. Um, for me, I am currently working on two costumes. Um, one is a secret. I'm sorry, won't be able to tell you. No one knows about it except for two people. But that's it, just two. Not one, two, not three, two. Um, it's from Soul Eater, and that's all I'm telling you. Secret cosplay from Soul Eater. You guys will find out when it's done. Um, second costume is from Hitman Reborn. Um, I really wasn't originally going to be making a Reborn cosplay for a while, but a certain few people, they are like, do it now. So I'm doing it now. And I'm doing uh, Mukuro Rokudo. So yeah, more insane people. Um, I'm hoping to have that done eventually. <laughs> um, definitely by Katsukan, which I'm going for the first time, so yay. And um, New York Anime Festival, I might have it Sunday, possibly. And my secret Solar cosplay will be done probably also by Katsukan, but I won't be wearing it there because someone is making me wait. But yeah, that's it for now. This I'm wearing Zyle now because that's the only costume costume I have with me at college because it's just I costumes take up a lot of space and I don't have the room. Yeah. Tagging time. All right, first person I'm tagging to do this. Let me go through my list of names here. probably didn't focus on that, but it says Serenus or Caesar or Caesar. You have to do it. I'm making you do it. Next person is my brother, Handsome the Stupid. You have costumes. You have a video camera. You have a computer. You can do it too. My third person I am tagging, Grando181. Daryl, I want you to do this too. And the last person is Kakashi's chick. Lexi! I know you want to do this. Extreme! Okay, so you can do it. I want you all doing this. Okay, I'll come get you. Or not. I'll stay here in Ithaca. Ithaca. Ithaca.